Alright, here we are. The recorded game, week two, Man V Fat. Finally, yeah. we're a bit late, but here we go. Yeah, so a few technical issues. Here tonight we have me, Quinny, and Green Gold Machine, Mr. James Cortman. Tonight we have Rockfort County against Fenafache. And on the ball we have Mr. Ian Coles, looking very dapper tonight. We've had some, uh, so, some good results so far. Just the, just the 50 goals for you tonight, JC? Uh, well, say 49. Tom Foreman's still stealing a few, so we'll, we'll let him off for tonight. After his 100 last season. <laughs> Brilliant turn by Scott. Great block there by Ben. We'll carry on the ball at the minute. Black's definitely the, the most improved team this season. I think it's, it's fair to say at this point, it's, it's Black's or Oranges to be the favourite this season. Yeah, after coming straight off from... Uh, a drubbing from the oranges from defending champions. He struck that like a proper cue ball on the back of his head as well. <laughs> oh, a lovely save there from Leighton. You know, the Blues always in with the chance of the wall in goals. I say Leighton, probably the, one of the hardest keepers to beat. Straight off the back of his air, uh, smashing 5% last, last week. And I, I can vouch for that. He was always a nightmare at Channel View to score against. I say it. Oh, he's not making him! Oh! Ooh. Ian having a rare venture up top. I was going to say his eyes must have lit up then. And just before he knew it, the lights were turned out. Silver on the ball. Oh. Oh, he's away. Oh, just as he's past the post. He's still wearing his banana shoes. Oh, Ian in acres of space again. He's just he's creeping in behind him there tonight. Oh, great touch there. Oh. Oh. oh, he thinks it over, but he's also gone past the goal as well. He did all the hard work. Oh, oh. nice to see Jenks back, sporting the uh, keeper gloves tonight. I think it's fair to say Ian Coles is finding all the space tonight. I'm definitely fancying him to uh, to bag a goal tonight. Yeah, he's, I think he's going to find an Ian Coles hat trick tonight. Seems to be everywhere at the minute. Oh, oh there we almost had it. We almost had it. Great save by Jenks at the other end. Oh, Plev with a long ranger. Oh, oh. Oh, oh fantastic what save. A save. Fantastic save there from Leighton. Feel the longer this game goes on, the more space there's going to be for both yeah. sides. It's really anyone's oh. game at the minute. Another phenomenal save by Leighton. It does feel at the minute, though, that uh, it's going to take something really special to beat Leighton at the minute. Absolutely. It's a shame I'm stood on the sideline. <laughs> it's not going to be me this week. Oh, oh. oh, he sat him down, but he just couldn't get it in. Good old Jenks barking the orders at the other end. He's definitely got to have a few, few returning faces back to Cardiff. And they are now at capacity and uh, looking to build towards getting another two teams, which is uh, some great work by, by all in the league and recruitment-wise this week. That would be fantastic news when we finally get there. Yeah. Joe, silky skills with Joe, sets up Harry. Oh, another fantastic oh. save by Leighton. Contentious handball there that Paul did not see. No. 
It'd be great to see a video replay of that one afterwards. Oh, oh here we've got a penalty. Oh, I must say, I must say that's very nah, nah, I think we might have to go to VAR for that. Oh, and VAR has just come back. Penalty to the Blacks. Scott Stanton stepping up against Peter Stilton in net. Oh, and he's crept in 1 0 to Fenerfache. Not the goal you want to open this game up, but it's a goal nonetheless. And that brings us to our first lot of subs. We got Panna coming on, Sellers, and Joey the Jaguar. Joey in his full matching attire, his red glasses, his red gloves, his red boots, he's on it tonight. Just looking like the ultimate professional. All the gear, no idea. Time, Sellers! Shoot! I'm now have Harry in net for Fenerfache. Jenks out doing what he does best, spraying balls around the pitch. It makes it look so simple. It's like a fine wine, he gets better with age. Jenks just shouting about a wrong hole here on the pitch leg. Like. Just makes it look far too easy. He does. And Joa, he's an um, absolute talent to play with as well. Uh, he's genuinely probably the, one of the nicest blokes that's ever seen to, to Man V Fat. He's a proper proper hero at Man V Fat, I think. Other than the initial first two seasons away from Channel View, I think he's one of the originals. Yeah, yeah, he's, he's, he's been around for a while. I think there's a massive group of us that joined then, didn't there, season yeah. three? Yeah, yeah. You know, he had his time away, but it's nice, nice to see him back. Definitely. Fantastic ball by Ian Bowles. That's out down the other end. Come over for an interview. <laughs> oh, great tackle there from Sol. Oh. oh, handball there from Jenks. Great save there from Harry. I must say, when Scott's on the bench, it's the quietest he's ever been. I think that's because he's out of breath as well. That's just, that's just Jenks. He's like a fine wine all over. I think, I think we just caught Leighton there, taking the ball out of the box in. Another contentious decision here. Oh, and that one was out of the box there. So in the game we expected to see so much of, two penalties. Hannah steps up. Oh, there we go, 1-1. One, one. <coughs> game on. Game on. Like Donkey Kong. Oh, here we go. Rockford County on the attack again. Panos has left Sellers for dead. They're not letting the back sleep on this one. Oh, oh, another fantastic save by Leighton. He's just everywhere. He's just everywhere. We've had some fantastic games today. I think the Reds lost their first game in 15 weeks, didn't yeah, they? we did. And that were no mean feat. The Oranges no. have really revitalised yeah, this season. It was and they're a, coming along very strong. It was a struggle. It was a struggle out there tonight, but we were definitely well beaten. <coughs> be interesting to see see how the scales fare at the end of the at the end of the night now. Yeah. Definitely some big losses on on all, all sides. I think tonight. Yeah. You know the, the green the greens haven't had any like outstanding big losses, but nine nine out of ten of us this 
Everton tonight have lost. So whether it's a small loss, they're all losses at the end of the night. That's it. That's where consistency is key. It's a, it's a marathon, not a sprint. And there we have uh, Sellers diving again. I think it's, it's, it all boils down to running with an iron fist, see? We'll leave no prisoners. Yeah. No long range effort from Jenks there. Oh, and Silva just leaving Sellers for dead. I think it's fair to say this week, I think one or two substitutes have hindered the Blacks on the pitch. Yeah. Last week they had such a good rhythm against the Greens, they were unstoppable, but they still seem to have that fl fluidity tonight. And the, here we go, the blues come again. Oh, lovely. Was that a dummy or was that a flick? He went for the spectacular. Sounds like a long green jacket. In style. Good hands there by Harry. Oh, a lovely oh. flick. He, he's, he's just dressed to play something spectacular, isn't he? He's he is. gonna just pull he it out is. Of the he just, just looks like a model professional. go that goal was all Joey that goal was all Joey after about 50 attempts all he finds the net some say it's a long time coming a nice 2-1 rock for uh, no 2-1 yeah. Fenefache my apologies yeah. that was fantastic running by Joey over on the far side there it was oh and that takes us to half time 2-1 blacks 2-1 Fenefache Pause down <laughs> Triple R. Rod was right. <laughs> and here we go, start the second half. Oh, and Ben, Ben were long ranger straight away. He wasn't far away either. Oh, control there from Plev. Doesn't matter how much weight you put on, the one thing you don't lose is your touch. Nope. Clever's got it in abundance. Just makes it look too easy. Oh, great hands there from Leighton. Just plucking it out of the air. You know, we've been at what, Man V Fat, what, four or five years? Yeah, yeah. Us. We've seen some fantastic goalkeepers come and go, mind. Yeah. We've had some proper. Well, Solid I think, goalkeepers. I think Leighton's probably been, all, all these years, been the, the standout. Don't matter what size goals you put him in, he's just a, he's just a brick wall. Got to give a shout out to Anthony Jones. Yeah, well. yeah, our Tony. You know, you know he's, he's up at Merthyr now doing well, but he was a proper stalwart in, the, in, in those goals, especially for a good couple of years. In, in, in goal, out of goal, he just, Everywhere. again, another full package. Got with a cheeky little nutmeg then. Oh, spilled the ball back out. We've got Joey in net now for the Blacks. <coughs> I think we need to remind Scott Stanton there's already two people on commentary tonight. <laughs> He's always got a rolling commentary. We'll have to see if we can guess, guess Scott down for the next game that, uh, that Fenefache had involved in. Yeah. Oh, he's clipped the post. Oh. And he knows he should have done better there. It's still anyone's game. As well, we still 2 1 black. 2 1 black. <coughs> I 
think legs are starting to catch up with the blues a little bit though I think this half yeah. the black still seems full of energy I think the substitutions have been well managed by the blacks now, so, now, yeah. that, they're, uh, now that they're ahead anyone I think they have Jürgen Klub on the side pulling the strings from but not they have someone better they have Joey the Jaguar pulling the strings that's from that's it oh Oh, two close shots there for me and then Panos. I still think the Blues are going to find a way back in this game. Oh, I'm, I'm definitely still fancying Ian for a goal. He's just got that glint in his eye tonight. The way he's been playing, some would think he wants a bash up front in the Bridgewater game coming up next. Oh. Oh. Uh, Absolutely oh. delightful football there by the Blacks. Oh, and there we go. Plev gets his goal, absolutely rifling that in. And I think that's going to be a perfect goal for the camera as well. He's right yeah. in view. Plev knows the cameras are rolling tonight. And he even looked with a smile, look at that. Bit harsh on the keeper, I thought, there. Yeah. Two fantastic saves, one after another. Especially with the, the trickery of Jenks there to sit him down. He still managed to, uh, to pull off two great saves. Well, I come at you with that much power, it's just there's nothing you can do with that. Ah, there we go. 4 1. 4 1, Fenerfache. The Fenerfache juggernaut has really well and truly kicked in now. Ben just r rallying the troops now, he's telling him to, to mark up a little bit just to steady the ship. Oh, Sellers giving away another another cheap free kick. Yet yeah, Paul still keeps his cards in his pocket. Will we see a card tonight? Oh, great mopping up there from Ben. Another great up and coming defender we've got, Manvi Fat there. Yeah. Ben makes it incredibly difficult to play against. Always seems to be in the right place at the right time. I think and he's smashing. A good yeah, and absolutely smashing it on the scales as well. A true leader for the Blues. Absolutely. I think it's great to see the atmosphere that we finally got back at Cardiff. Yeah. Everyone's smiling, everyone losing weight. It's, it's just what we've needed since our move to goal now. Yeah. That's been a breath of fresh air. Jenks trying to sneak one in in the bottom corner. Oh, lovely crossfield ball there from Sol. Last subs, boys, last subs. And last subs from Paul. We're into our final seven. Paul, oh, quick one. Me and Quinny have been taking bets to see a colour of a card tonight, but you're still keeping them in your pocket. No, Any no. explanation for this? Yes, everyone's been friendly and playing to the rules. Well, what more can you ask for? Correct, yeah, David. Oh. A dream night. A dream night for yeah, any ref in Cardiff. Uh, any controversials at all tonight, except for shin pads. <laughs> <laughs> oh, shin pad scandal yeah, is going yeah. on. A reminder to, to anyone watching this that if you are going to play, you have to wear shin pads. Rule yeah. number one. Because our very own Kalina doesn't miss a trick, that's for sure. <laughs> <laughs> oh, fantastic oh, save again from Leighton. <coughs> I think Jenks with his little comment then just hit the nail on the head. Straight up shot one on one with Leighton. You're always going to favour the goalkeeper at that point. Yeah. A lovely little thing there for me. And the Blues have struck gold with their player there. Pan is a real handful when he got the ball at his feet. He really is. he got a fantastic touch on him as well. Oh, 
he tried it, it nearly came off. But here come the blacks again. Oh. Oh, another fantastic double save from Leighton. He's got to be surely be uh, the Blues man of the match. Oh, well, that's a doubt. Doubt. Another save again. Oh, was Scott not in the box then? Uh, it did look like Scott may have run through the box there. I think, I, that's think I think that's definitely one to look at after the game. I think it's fair to say without later though, this game would be yeah. over long ago. Yeah, definitely dead and buried a long time ago. But what are we at? 4 1 now? 4 1. Game's not over yet. Fantastic tackle from Panner on the edge of the box. And we have Scott <laughs> appealing for, for every decision, to be fair. Oh, Ooh, Ian Coles goes close. Strong words from Paul 10 minutes ago. I think he might be eating them at the end now. Oh, Straight to Leighton. Again, down. another save. Keeping him in the game. Absolutely, we were just saying that. He's been an absolute <laughs> rock in that net. The only man be fat league in Wales with a homeless person refing. You reckon? <laughs> the plastic one outside JD. <laughs> Just have uh, joined join by Jenks telling us that uh, resident ref Paul looks like a cult hero in uh, Cardiff Centre. We've been assured that uh, Paul does have a home and is not homeless. Panas there again, mopping everything up. Morning, up in here. Panas goes well close to the long range effort. <laughs> oh, I love the toast yeah. look out there from me. <laughs> Surely we must be into the final yeah, couple of minutes. Keep the keeper, keep the keeper. Oh, we've got a late, a late substitute. I think uh, Ben Ben's pulled off with a bit of an injury. We don't like. No one likes to see okay, that. Keep it ready. Keep the work going. Well done. After a lovely day, don't I have to get cold out on the pitch? Yeah. Right? This time last week we had a lovely summer's evening. Now she feels like we're going back to uh, back to winter. Oh, the only thing we're missing is a good old April showers. Ah, uh, don't be jinxed us just, just yet. Oh, There's still time. Oh, a fantastic tackle on the edge of the box. Oh, he's just caught by the by the post on the side of the pitch. Brilliant, well played. Well played, Scott. Quicker with that ball, lad. Good, Addy. Time, time, go with Wayne. Come on, Addy. Oh, here we are. Oh, five one. Another goal from Ollie. We're into our final two minutes now here. Oh. Almost there. Is there time for another blues goal? My smiley still on Ian Coles to snatch one before the end of the day. The blues started off so well. I just think the sheer determination and relentless press pressure. Oh, fantastic. Oh, and Matt oh, Silva, oh, fantastic. Oh. We did see if there was time for another blue goal, and there it was. Did you see the footwork from Panna leading up Amazing. to that? Amazing. Oh, I thought that was Ian Coles' moment. That's better, that's better. Excellent, Oli. Keep a keep a run going all. Oh. And I think Joe Pledge just put this game well and truly to bed now. Yeah, another fantastic finish. No comebacks from he, only, here now. he has took some really special goals to actually beat Leighton tonight. 
And that's full, full that's credit to him. Whoa, a cheeky little throw out there from Sellers. Shows he's really enjoying it tonight. Jolene. Jolene, Jolene. Yeah, ha, yeah, ha, do it. Same way, Ollie. Oh, oh well played. Joel, have it up. Good football. With a few seconds left, I'm sure Scott is just thinking about his kebab now at the end of the night. Last couple of seconds, boys. Go, Joe, go, Joe. Oh. oh, he thought Ian was about to pinch it in there at the end. You can see the whites of his eyes glisten. Oh, wow. And that's got to be a goal of the season contender there. Wow. What's that? What's our final wow. score there, ref? 7-2. And a 7-2 to Fenefache. A fantastic evening here. Week just two. To say, just to say, boys, I hope the referee for the next three weeks has got good standards like uh, Mr. Rod has tonight. So I will be here for the next three weeks. So well, I'm, I'm, I'm sure he's not going to turn up in a Morrison's jacket, that's for sure. <laughs> so we got no highlight of the night there, that's for sure. All the best, boys. And that's it for this week. That's been me and me and from, from me, Quinny and JC. Another great game.